Star Jones recently wrote on Facebook, it is extremely difficult and often impossible to get the media to pay attention to the murder of an African-American woman. So if it takes screaming from the rooftop, then scream we shall. Those words were written in response to the tragic death of 32-year-old Rosalind Rhonda Lee, whose body was found floating in Pontiac's Terry Lake on Sunday morning of Memorial Day. It wasn't too far from her home. Someone strangled Rhonda and possibly sexually assaulted her since all of her clothes were missing except for her shirt. It is a horrific story. Um, Rhonda leaves three babies, oh. a nine-month-old, a six-year-old, and a 12-year-old. And um, all of Rochelle's girlfriends, all of the Ransom family friends really have been there for them, doing what, whatever we can. So I'm not special. Uh, our sorority sisters have been driving folk where they need to be, sitting with folk, bringing food, the things that we do yeah. when somebody uh, loses a family member. Well, what I can contribute is my big mouth mm -hmm. and the platform that pr my profession allows me. So I contacted all of my media friends. I sent uh, about 150 to 180 emails. Sent you one. I appreciate you bringing me here to talk about this. Um, sent all of my media friends, and they have responded in droves. Wow. People were really touched by this story. And also, I think um, everybody recognizes how tough it is to get the media to focus attention, especially national media, on an African-American woman. Yeah. I put my NAPW team to, to work this past week, and we created what you know now is Rhonda's Rules. Rhonda's Rules, yes. Um, and it's really for you all out there, and that's why I'm just sort of looking at you right now. This is for every woman to have a uh, sort of checklist of what you need to do to prepare in case the unthinkable happens. If you have children, if you have any property whatsoever, you need to make sure you have a will. You need to make sure if there's kids, there's a testamentary trust of some kind set up for their 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 own personal and um, and financial well-being. You need to make sure you have all of your passwords written down somewhere and all yes. of your websites written down somewhere. You need to make sure in a letter you spe specify where you want personal items to go. Um, I don't have any children, but I have a precious pet, my pinky. I want to make sure she goes to somebody who wants to take care of her. Mm -hmm. um, I would absolutely want to focus who's going to be the guardian. And this was an issue that Rhonda's family had to deal with. Um, because she was unmarried, the, the remaining biological parent has the first right Right. of the children. But if you don't think that that parent is fit, you need to make sure you actually document why that parent is not fit should something happen to you. So my friends had to go into court to get temporary guardianship. So I've created Rhonda's Rules. It is a huge checklist, but it will benefit every single woman out there and a whole lot of men.